Hey everybody, how's it going? Today we're going to do some units on air gotcha because I am going to do something that I haven't done in this game and you can see it below here. I haven't made a fancy scrolling thing here. I'm going to be rolling until I get the precious Saito Kyoko card or I end up hitting the ceiling. This game does feature a uh, limit in which you can actually uh, exchange um, for a specific card if you have pulled enough times, which is 25 10 pulls. Um, you can see it here. Every, ten pull, every pull you do earns you um, 100 uh, of these badges. And of course, if you do a 10 pull, that's 100 of them. So you can see I've done 14 10 pulls so far, and I haven't gotten that Saito Kyoko card yet. Um, I, of course, aiming for this one right here. So you can see that means I need to do 11 more 10 pulls and I'm guaranteed to exchange for this card assuming I don't screw up somewhere along the way. Today we are going to be pulling until the limit or I get that Saito Kyoko card. If I get that card I end immediately. Um, otherwise you know you're going to see me adding some money, throw some money at the problem here and hope that I can save some of that uh, before I hit the ceiling. I know I guess I wish I could have saved some of my uh, gems. <laughs> I would have gladly uh, not pulled in the other, um, uh, you know, for the other cards if I had known this was coming. And I guess it's unfortunate that Kyonko ended up in the first section for this, so um, I have to immediately uh, pull for that. As you can see, this uh, does end um, tomorrow at the time of a recording, so. Unfortunately, I won't be able to get the 1,000 uh, plus gems from the last set of missions for the uh, panel missions. Anyways, enough talking. Let's start gotching. Here is the last set of gems that I got from running, uh, you know, finishing off the missions in the... Uh, um, not the missions. Just the, uh, you know, the reward tiers for... <sighs> All of the songs, you know, that I haven't cleared yet, and of course, um, getting the um, uh, drama uh, gems for just watching things. And it's a house studio, so of course this certainly means that I'm not going to get uh, Kyonko here. And of course we know that when there's a signed card, uh, the load is pretty reliable in that it will be in the 90% range to start. Um, I know lately the, um, you know, I have been, oh man, you bitch on to start. Um, I have been, you know, noticing that I have been getting SSRs even though the load starts from a low number. Um, so I, it's really hard to tell, but it still seems like if there's a special load with the uh, signage, that that almost always is starting at 90%. So uh, that should be the good sign whether or not um, I get it. So Bakshi, so that gets me up to 15. Um, so we start adding money. And you know, luckily there is there are a few um, campaigns that I haven't purchased quite yet, so I can take advantage of this. Um, the plan here is I'm going to do the uh, 5,000 gem pack first, and then I'll do the uh, 12,500 gem pack, which is 5 pulls. So that's a total of 7. And then I can buy um, the discounted pack for 1,500, which is not exactly a 10 pull, but after that it's all about um, you know just spending 50 bucks at a time to get two t pulls at a time so and I'm gonna do this in chunks just because again if I can save money I would love to do that but um, and yeah you can't see my card information great verify purchase oh this is scary I am not a person that likes to spend money like this, so... Um, Alright. There you go. So, got the first pack there, which gives me two temples. And yeah, I know, maybe some of y'all out there will be like, why don't you just spend it? Well, I want to... Even though I'm not really doing much with... With money in terms of buying things, going out, and doing things because of the whole situation. Um, I still don't like to spend money like this. 
Anyways, here we go. Boom. Let's see. Sarimakashi, Osushi, Manafi, and Kyonko. Well, I mean, Kyonko's in the fourth slot, so that's pretty much. Again, remember this. This game does feature rates at six percent, so um, it is quite a feat to get four tem four SSRs. Um, oh, and I think right, she was the first one, so I'm pretty much screwed. Um, but again, the um, specific cards you see here are only 0.5% each, so uh, that is a total of 2% that it is one of those new cards, so um, the chances of getting these cards are not so great. Next. Oh, here we go, here we go, guys. So that's a good pull, alright? That's a good pull. It started out in the you know the latter half of the ninety percent. The question is, ah, mana fee. Okay, so mana fee isn't the you know of the four. So hopefully this just means it's a new mana fee card, which is always great to see. Um, I do believe mana fee has a really strong. One of the her cards is really strong. And since there are only two responses, um, if you know, this ends up being a good roll. There's always a chance could get a bonus somewhere along the way. Ooh, another gold. Meep. Ah, uh, okay. Well, I have this card. Obviously, it doesn't say new, but um, it is that joyful love card is really strong. Ah, that might be it. Kyonko. Ah, a dupe SSR. Okay. Yes, I wish I could review, but since you region lock, I cannot. Okay, so I forgot I can pay from the screen. All right, so let's go for the big pack now. That is another, this is a hundred bucks that I'm dropping here. Okay, hold on. Let me... I am actually going to hide this real quick. Actually, you know what? Let me pause the video. I'll be right back. Okay, we are back. And there we go. Spent another ooh, 100. Got five more temples ready. That is... We're almost there to the end. Let's see. There we go. Another good load. Here we go guys, this is a chance, this is a good chance, let's see. Kyoko! Ah, Miho, okay! Miho is one of the good ones, so if... And her uh, skill is, I believe, the one that you do want. Um, so that'd be two great cards to get for sure. And to be able to get... Three out of four would be really good, you know, in the end. And since we only saw one response, who knows? Yeah! Miho! Yeah, that's a. Another SSR. Yeah. All right, there we go, guys. Got another precious card. It is Watanabe Miho. But I mean, of course, I'm here for Saito Kyoko, not Miho. Even though, like I said, her her skill does look pretty nice there with the all 40% um, bonuses if you get a full rainbow team going. Um, We'll definitely be unlocking her card too, so. Alright! But we're not done here, right? The message right here says Precious Saito Kyoko, not Precious Watanabe Miho, so. Let's do another temple and see. Right, and again, like, the load is very obvious, so. Uh, of course, hitting that 2%. Otake Kyonko Watanabe Miho. Okay, so let's 
So I'll keep hope alive, but again, since the load didn't happen, gonna be a little bit pessimistic. Any new SSRs would be great though, although I do have all Kyonko, uh, oh no, Otake SS, SR to begin with. I think we can dash all hopes here with that first card being Otake and not giving anything. But you know what? More keys for Kyonko and Miho are really good right now because I am going to need a lot to unlock their cards. Okay, decent load. It was a really high 90, so that makes me think it's kind of like what we saw before with Mana Fee. Um, let's see though. Katoshi Kosakana. Okay, Matsuda Kono and Sarimakashi. So that's two guaranteed SSRs there. And I start with an SSR with that uh, faded uh, cut in. So Kosakana, I don't have a lot of, so. Oh, yes! Katoshi's Happy Oro card is really strong. Yes, another Kosaka card. Okay. Well, this is really awesome, guys. Oh, and I guess I lost my third chance there with Konoka, but that's just asking for too much for sure. But, the, you know, two solid, solid cards right there is really great to see. Especially I'm dropping down this kind of money on this game. Um, this will definitely help me fix my f uh, red team. Um, yeah. Yeah. Just a solid uh, red leader skill. So we'll see. I don't know if it's good enough to top. Um, who do I have in red right now? Um, oh, yeah. Uh, Ushio Sarimakashi. I have her in that slot. So... We'll see if it's good enough to flip. Um, of course, Kosakana, not a solid card. You know, a life support isn't what you want, but... How can you complain about a Kosakana card? You can't. Alright. Let's keep going. Keep going, keep going. Manafi Katoshi Kyonko Iguchi. Okay. Well, the load doesn't indicate anything good coming out of this, but um, let's just hope. Just keep hoping, guys. Katoshi. Manafi. Alright. I've already lost all hope for this, so. Kyonko? There you go. More Kyonko keys at least. Alright, last temple before I have to start busting out more money again. Alright, guess I'm having to bust out more money. Katoshi. Katoshi's coming a lot today. Otake, Kageyama, and Kawada. I mean, not that I mind seeing Katoshi a lot, because I, I also... Did I finish unlocking her... Her card stats? I forget. But for the most part, I have. I just haven't gotten enough plays on her to unlock the uh, movie there. But, you know, because I have been spending all my energy clearing things for those um, gems. Alright, well, I think that's it for that. Alright, let's go back here, and honestly, you know, I was thinking it actually makes no sense to buy the uh, first pack, because it doesn't give me enough to do a temple, so I guess we'll go straight for the uh, the uh, $100 pack here, right? Wait, how much do I need to do? Yeah, I need three more, so you know what? Yeah, I guess dropping another hundred here. Give me a sec. Oops. Do 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 do
There we go. Cocking. No, I guess it's kind of sad that they don't make a noise. All right. Well, here we go, guys. Let's just wrap this up. And of course, the the biggest, you know, spike in the end would be a, on the like 25th pull I end up getting her. All right, Kawada Iguchi Katoshi again. Let's see, Kawada, you know, I end up using her a lot in my teams, right? Not only did I get that, you know, anniversary um, card of hers for that new Fleek skill, which is very interesting, right? Um, because, you know, you are banking on the fact that it activates early in the Fleek, the 20% the bonus region. And, oh! Ah, Kawada! I'm gonna... Ichigo, if you're watching for you you know you know the more you get of you know all of the members and you know especially when it's a costume card you have the opportunity of that turning into an SSR plus card um, which you know if you're watching from Monster Strike think of it as a Jushinka kind of thing where you know you get that transcension level um, where you have your base skill but it's just even stronger on top of that so um, um, and it only applies to a certain set of cards, so getting these, um, you know, um, outfit cards are really useful. So um, definitely worth. Um, and oh yeah, yeah. And the the cool thing here is that they changed it so that if you get any of the uh, uh, graduated uh, members, so you see Iguchi here, um, you get key pieces instead rather than you know their particular. Um, you know key uh, because obviously they have graduated so for a lot of people who have been playing this game from the start um, will have no uses for them anymore but uh, you still need them um, you have the option to change it back directly to hers uh, let's see Sarimakashi and Kosakana because um, you might want to unlock stuff that is Yiguchi but again you certainly wouldn't want it um, if it's any if you already finished all of her cards, for example. Which actually, I'm pretty close to finishing all of Iguchi's cards. So, um, that is really, really nice. That is a very awesome quality of life update. And, you know, the folks from Akatsuki who do play, who make this game for Units on Air, they are really, really... Uh, I, I haven't had such a positive impression of, you know, an app developer like this, which... Yes, I'm spending an insane amount of money here, but... Aha! Ushio! Very nice. Ah, no Kosakana pickup there, but... Another get here. Timing support. Okay, so she's not going to go anywhere, but... I mean, again, the fact that it's a potential SSR plus card it could um, beast into something amazing okay here you go guys this is gonna be my last temple for the Hinata side I am guaranteed to get uh, to exchange for a Kyonko card here um, let's see okay so the pull looks like I'm not gonna get her naturally here which is a shame but um, that is perfectly fine which also means Let's see, we got Hina no Nano, Kawada, and Manamo as the responses. Which means I am going to once again miss out on Matsuda Kono. Um, I, I just, I guess this game must have me really, really struggling to get her cards. Oh, speak of the devil. And you know, her, her latest blog post was so touching. You know, the members, uh, they, they folded a thousand cranes for her, which is, you know something a symbol symbolical thing you do when somebody's sick and you want them to you know do well you know as a group all the members the managers the staff the makeup crew all of them work together to do this amazing thousand crane you know um, uh, you know gift for Konoka and she made a post about that her blog post about that and 
uh, you know, it just shows how, you know, how tight this group really is and just how much they truly appreciate each other. And, you know, I just can't wait for her to come back. Oh. Anyways, 2,500. <sighs> That's a lot. But you know what? That does let me, I guarantee, the Saito Kyoko card. Double check. Precious Saito Kyoko. And yes. Unfortunately, there's no cut in, which is a shame. But thankfully, um, I can watch the video of the uh, the sign cut in afterwards. So, all right. So that means at the end for Hinanta, I was able to get Katoshi, Watanabe Miho, and exchange for Saito Kyoko. And um, you know what? Just for kicks. No, 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 no. I need to save gems at this point. I was thinking maybe I would do Kiaki here. Sorry, not Kiaki. Sakura Zaka. Ah, <sighs> should I? You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna get a lot of gems back. Let's just do this once for Sakura Zaka. And let's call it a day. Um. Let's see, Watanabe, Dika, followed by Lisa, and then Takemoto Yui. So, let's see. I mean, yeah, I don't have that many Keaki cards in comparison, so any hits are good. Obviously, I got ridiculously lucky with um, hitting, uh, oh, Habu. Okay. Well, that means there should be one more gold card along the way. Nice! Watanabe Rika! That means Lisa and Takemoto are still on the board for upgrades. Ah, gold. Okay, and that means it's wrapped up. Okay, hey, that was worth it. Nice pull at the end to get Rika. Timing, so okay, so not useful, but again, it is a costume card, so again, that lets me give the opportunity to boost my team there. So, okay, well, that is it for all of the pulls. Um, let's see, we can go here. Um, you know, this is really nice, and I mean, unfortunately. You know, I don't think... Well, actually, let's see. Yeah, the sign movie's up there, so let's just get that. Let's just skip that. And yes, I am going to watch that later. That's going to be amazing. But, you know, here is, you know, what I was hoping to see, you know, in-game. It obviously looks much cooler when you pull and that cutting comes in with the sign. Uh, but at the very least, at least, you can watch it here. Ah, Kai. There you go. I guess it's a little bummer you don't have the boom effect that you know you see on the cut in, but um, anyways, I got I don't have enough keys right now, but you know since I got the uh, what the Gucci card, honestly, and I guess that's very fitting that Saito Kyoko's uh, best friend. Uh, unfortunately, who graduated um, is going to be able to contribute to unlocking the last few gates for her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll watch that later. Um, and I really wish they would change this so that it would make it easier to like, like look at how small that button is. Like, I'm never going to use max because I don't want to use, um, you know, all of my keys at once. And so, like, if they would do it, like, oh, shoot. Well, well anyways, I'm going to have to buy 60 again next. But, you know, if they would fix this, so just, like, go to 50, go to 40, go to 60, or at least 10 at a time. Or make it, like, inline editable or something like that so it's easier to get to the level that I want. Um... But, yeah. 
And of course, you know, the, the really cute cards are the ones in the middle. You know, she's like lying down uh, towards the camera. Mm. Okay, so another 60. I guess I could have done that ahead of time, but whatever. But, you know, you gotta play, you actually gotta use the cards enough times so that it is um, unlockable. That's what that meter is on the gates. Um, so it's not like you can just get the card and you're done. You have to actually use them, even though they might not be the ideal skill sets or anything like that. Um, but you know what? When it comes to your Oshi, it doesn't matter, right? All you care is getting that card and be able to, um, uh, you know, basically see your Oshiman there um, in all its glory. And, mm, and so like this... Basically, this unlock here allows you to get this new screen that you know you occasionally see when I'm you know looking at the members um, data and stuff. Right? It always just pops up here. It's just a I mean it's only five seconds, but so elegant. Oof, kawaii. I mean, of course. Now, I mean, we know that the rest of the members are gonna get these eventually. I am not gonna chase for anybody else afterwards unfortunately like I mean I guess it's nice that you know normally I don't have Katoshi set on my four um, it is it is always Kyonko, Manamo, uh, Suzy and uh, Miho as my top four here and then I just rotate whoever I want to see on the fifth slot but it is pretty cool to see them all like that three of them having that special effect Ah, it's just this is a lot of money that to pour in a, a single game, right? Ah, yeah, I shouldn't think about that. It's just let's just look at that Kyunko card again. Well, actually, let's take a look at you know the haul that I got here. So, um, right, you know, getting that new Kawada card and uh, Ushio card for Kitsune, which is a really good. Um, oh wait, that's not the right order. Um, let's see. Right? Oh no, we got a lot. Actually got a lot of hits today, right? So we got Miho here, right? The first um, hit of the day, getting her, um, um, you know, signed version, which of course I'll lo unlock that later. I won't bore you with that now. And then being able to Katoshi's Happy Aura card is really exciting for me. I do believe that that gets a uh, fast lane to the uh, uh, red team that I have there. And then a very, very beautiful Kosakana card here. Um, unfortunately not usable, but good to unlock. Kawada in her Kitsune outfit, again. Um, great card to unlock, not necessarily to use. Followed by Sarimakashi's Kitsune as well to watch. And then of course Kyonko, which will be usable. Um, you know, high stats and you know the unique leader skill with the uh, voice and performance uh, biases. Um, and finally, a nice bonus at the end to get a Rika card uh, for Sakura Zaka. Uh, very interested to see how and when they convert to Sakura Zaka in game. And of course, can't forget that the new uh, second gen for Sakura Zaka and third gen for Hinata Zaka will be coming probably by the end of the year. So uh, probably we'll be saving gems up for that. Um, and of course, God knows what they're going to do at the New Year's, which is probably going to be the next time I spend some money in this game. But until then, I'm going to stay tight, save gems, and probably just do maybe a single temple here and there when Kyonko shows up. You know, inevitably, right? She'll show up. But, um, oh, what was I doing? I should have collected the keys first before spending the key pieces. Oh, well. Anyways, too excited to get Kyonko. Um... Yeah, let's end with the joyful love Kyonko there. So if you stuck around for this whole video, thank you for watching. That's 30 minutes of me pulling and um, hoping to get Kyonko. Unfortunately, I had to hit the ceiling, so maxed out on the amount of money to drop on this game for that. But let's hope it's worth it. I don't want to think about it too much. I'm going to go start pulling my Monster Strike uh, pulls and hope that ends up being better. So 
until next time thank you for watching if you enjoy this content go ahead consider uh, subscribing again mostly videos here are monster strike related but i do um, obviously uh, pepper in some uh, unison air gotchas along the way um, like subscribe and follow the twitter account if you are so interested so until next time bye bye